I'm Danny Cobden and welcome to this week's Market Pulse. Today we're going to have a look at last night's federal budget and in particular how it will affect the real estate market. Leading up to the budget, there was much commentary about addressing the housing affordability issue and it didn't come as a surprise that first home buyers would receive some benefits. From July this year, buyers saving to buy their first home will get a tax cut on deposit savings up to $30,000 from their pre-tax income to go towards a first home deposit. At the other end of the spectrum, the budget has also introduced measures to encourage older people to downsize from their existing homes by giving tax breaks to those who reinvest funds into pension funds. In respect of property investors, no significant changes have been made in relation to negative gearing. However, the government have introduced tighter controls in relation to some allowable deductions, such as travel costs. Foreign investors will have to face tougher rules, with their main residence no longer being capital gains tax-free exempt, and there will also be a ghost tax introduced for those investors who leave their properties vacant for six months or longer in any one year. Additionally, there will also be a cap of 50% of sales to foreigners in new developments. In other community news, Ben Southwell from our Annandale team is a big supporter of Heart of Annandale, which features local musicians and artists. Opening night is tomorrow night, but please check out the website annandale.org.au for the complete program of events. There are some amazing artworks on display, uh, workshops for both adults and kids, and an all-day music festival. Next, we'll move over to the Balmain Markets on Saturday where we have a number of our team hosting a cake stall to raise money for the National Breast Cancer Foundation. So if you'd like to enjoy some nice cakes, come and see our team at the Balmain Markets across the road from Gladstone Park on Saturday between 9 to 3 p.m. Next, we'll move over to the Russell Lee Public School Fete, being held on Saturday between 10 to 4 p.m. Our Dremoyne team are great supporters of this local fete, and they'll be there enjoying themselves. And don't forget to see our magician on stage at 12 o'clock. Last but certainly not least, our Marrickville team is supporting the Fern Court Family Fair being held on Saturday between 10 to 4 p.m. in Marrickville. This is a pretty special sponsorship as we're donating the commission from a house sale to the school. So if you know of anyone selling in the greater Marrickville area over the next 12 months, here's a great opportunity to support the local school and have them have the entire sales commission rather than the agent. So if this is something that may be of interest, please get in contact with Jim at our Marrickville office and it represents a great opportunity to not only sell with the market leaders, but to also make a big impact financially to the local school. So that's it for this week. Thanks for watching and we'll see you out and about. Bye for now.